Mike Nissen, one of the organisers here at Hanover Affairs. Mike, fantastic event you put together this year. Thanks, Lawrence, and of course, thanks to Import Export TV. Wonderful to be here yet again. This is huge. I mean, it's such a fantastic venue at the Dome here in Sydney, and it just keeps going on and on and on. Everyone I speak to is blown away by the, the stand set up. Yeah, I do have to say that, you know, there's been a considerably much bigger effort put into the stands this year. I think last year was coming back from COVID and everyone was, uh, I guess, a little bit standoffish to see what was going to happen. But this year, everyone realises that, you know, the world is free and yet yeah, we're back with events and, yeah, it's looking absolutely great. You know, there's a good buzz again around the venue. Um, and we've had some, you know, great new companies come in and, yeah, some awesome visitors, which is great. Yeah, I've, I've heard so many people say that they're going to come back, because today's only day one, they're going to come back tomorrow and bring some other colleagues with them as well because they're, they're so impressed. Yeah, and I think what, what you find is with uh, events like this is that people will come and look around and then go back and think about things a little bit further and then come back and ask more questions because they are actually here to solve problems um, for their warehousing logistics needs. Yep. And the other big takeaway for me this year, Mike, is that there's a lot of overseas companies wanting to really hit the Australian market hard. Yep, definitely. So again, um, the world has opened up, so we do have that opportunity to have a lot more um, overseas visitors, but we're also seeing a lot more from Europe as well. So. Yeah, it's great to see. Great. Well, congratulations again, mate. I'm sure we'll talk to you again over the next couple of days. And, uh, yeah, it's an awesome event, so well done. Thanks very much, Lawrence, and thanks Import Export TV. Cheers.